guys welcome back to yet another vlog <laughs> oh, guys if you are new here welcome to the club if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much for your continued support and welcome back okay guys um today i am meeting up with my mom emol um okay here's the story the background story Ubabani bought me shoes, right? And for my birthday, as a uh, birthday gift. So this is actually this is in Kulu. He bought me a size seven, and guys, Nina, I'm between a five and six. But to be safe, buy me a size six. So he bought me a seven, and those shoes are big. Like guys, I tried winging it, wearing those shoes with socks, but no accidents. So yeah, he then um. Yesterday we went to exchange them um, to a size six, only to find out what my figure now for like little bit too as sick. Cook silly very like like I'm a size I'm a cool. So then he then suggested that I meet up with my mom today, um, so that we can exchange those shoes and probably get something that I would prefer, something that I would like. He video called me yesterday showing me options of shoes he should exchange and I'm not so sure about this man's taste anymore. Either Agasaya Zi Tastiam or I'm sorry if you're gonna be watching this dad, but I your taste lately I'm so sana uh -uh. count me out. So the safe way is for me to go there and actually pick something that I would actually pre prefer. So yeah, this is where I'm going today. I'm going to meet with my mom, then my dad is gonna join in later. So yeah, Nyalapo, I've already started getting ready, guys. The only thing left is for me to wear shoes. Um and just to wear socks and shoes, and yeah. I will see you guys at the mall. Um, yeah, also guys, um, I can't keep calling you guys. Maybe Masnatola a new name for um studies, you know. Um I know um other studies have names um, um other channels have names for their um studies. So if you've got um suggestions on what we can call one another on this channel please comment drop a comment leave a comment for me behind then um we'll get to choose which one works for our channel so yeah guys i will see you at the mall okay guys i'm done this is how i look um the liquid pens are from fashini the gray jersey um, turtleneck is from fashini as well um the long sleeve white vest is from Woolies and my kicks are from Spotsini. These are vans. So yeah, I'll check you guys later.
hope you are well. Um, today is a Friday. I am going to collect um, orders for my clients. And then it hit me, guys. It hit me just the other day. I was sharing positivity. I was sharing verses with you. However, and I told you guys how you should trust in the Lord, how you should believe in Him forever. Yena, wara wara, you get me. And then it hit me with it, but Palisa, wena. Okay, background for those who don't know what I do for a living. I'm a small business owner. I have an online store whereby I sell um, home, kitchenware and home decor. Um, uh, and then I also sell jewelry for a living. That's how I make income. Isinkwasami, that's my bread and butter. But for the longest time, guys, I haven't been posting and marketing my business because I was hacked. You know, someone tried to someone tried to hack my website, but they successfully hacked my um, Instagram page, where I actually put my things out there for people to see what's available for them to purchase so i was hacked guys i was so mad i was so angry. i was like you know but why aren't the ones you know thank god to um the person who's um responsible for my website someone is really trying to come into the website so yeah, I was very much demotivated and discouraged for the longest time. I think I stopped posting in I think March. Yeah, March. However, people still buy from me. I think it's retaining um customers who know about me. Guys, this is Singwa Sam that's how I make a living, that's how I pay for my bills. I'll forever be grateful to my partner for being for being supportive and for my parents to be able to still take care of me regardless regardless english if i catch you <laughs> regardless um so today ni vugenji ni ni no more and ni positive but why ugela lento le epilisa your pants why are you pompous and saying ah you know what people know about me they'll buy no, it does not work like that. If you don't put your business out there, how will people know about it? So if you are a business owner, whether it's big or small, you will know what I'm talking about. There are days whereby it's literally dry, it's dark, like I have a lot of challenges. And yes, I do get demotivated. So since on Wednesday, this has been ringing in my mind, but it's like, get up. And when you get up, go take that phone, record, and actually motivate someone to actually get up. And continue with their daily routines. So yeah, that's my two cents. Nam guys. Um just get up and go. No excuses. Just start that business, just market that business. Go hard, guys. Like, there's no tomorrow. Mina, mina, I'm rich. Like, I want money, guys. So, I go where the money is at. And at the moment, this has been, this has been my income for the longest time. So, I will not take it for granted. It pays my bills. That's how I get by. I make a living out of it. So, I will not take this blessing lightly. I will not take this for granted. Is Kati so shala uti I and be like also trying to be humble, man? How will people know? That's the message I'm trying to get out there, guys. Would you just get up, zintite, do your best. Just wake up and do your best. If you are a nine to five vuga, do your best. If you're a business owner, vuga, do your best. But yeah, I'll be starting now to post um more about my business it will be featured a lot in this um channel so to those who didn't know please follow me on my instagram pages um i will link them below for you guys to check them out and yeah guys and yeah i'll see you later i'm going to collect orders package them 
and then Moise um, Bumakuri has for my customers to get their packages. So I'll see you guys. Bye. Another day, another errand look. Um, so today, Nikoge, um, denims from Wanyana Bogat. Guys, you should check her out. Her denims are amazing and affordable. Just go on Instagram and say Wanyana Bogat, you'll find her. Next, I am wearing a jersey from Guess. Yeah, I got it from Guess. And then my kicks are from Edgar's. And my bag is from Forever New. Yeah, but if you see the bag, I was a kuluma. I shame Gubia Shutsi Sissing Pumuse. I'm always carrying it. Like, I don't know why. It's so, I think it fits most of my items. So, I guess I should be buying more black bags then. So, yeah. That's it for today. Bye. Um, guys, um, a customer ordered, um, two of these. Um, I was actually on my way back home when she called and asked me to just deliver at her workplace. So since we in Leila, I did not mind. So I am currently waiting outside her workplace for her to come and collect her items. Hi guys, I just got back and I thought before we got busy, um... Let me show you um, what I got yesterday. Remember I told you I'm going to exchange shoes that my dad bought for me. So let me show you. Let me plug you. Guys, your, it's end of season sale. I'm telling you, shops are running 50% sale. What would sale. So this would really be a perfect time for you to buy that boot, that expensive boot, um, obviously at a cheaper rate. That jacket you wanted so badly, but it was expensive in um, in win beginning of winter. But now, um, the bakate my price as well. So yeah, let me show you what I got yesterday. Um, I got these gems. These gems, guys. Like I'm so happy about this purchase. Um, these were initially going for. $529, but I got them for $400. So, guys, literally, I saved. I saved money. And then I also got these. My dad was like, okay, because these are on sale, you can get something else. So, I bought these. Um, these are not on sale, but I liked them. They were they are $399. So, if you go to Woolworths, you'll find these. These are $399. I liked them so much. I enjoy being casual these days. So any flat shoe or any sneaker would do. So under a thousand guys, I got a two pair of shoes. So run to Woolies, run, don't walk, run. So yeah, can't wait to style them. Um, you can go through my Instagram page to see how I style my items. And then guys, I went to Akamens. A comments woman my sister plugged me and i was so impressed guys like nice 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 things so let me show you what i got at a comments woman and i also saw if you're on instagram follow um G Lamine. she also did like a nice reel of items she got from a comments woman i was influenced so let me show you what i got okay uh, I got this white dress. This white dress, guys, I got it for 120. Huh? 120, guys. You? Icon. And then I got bras, like two for 200. Guys, I am sick and tired of buying bras. I don't even know my size anymore. I thought I was a 36C. But then I got to Ackermann's yesterday. I'm a, what's this? This is the 38C. Guys, I, I, every month my boobs are growing. We'll talk about this pandemic some other time. But no, guys, I'm always buying bras. It's, if it's not my underwear, it's bras. My booty is literally growing every day. So, but yeah, I got, if you know, if you've got like big boobs, you will know how expensive bras are. So if I get to buy 
bras for under 200 for two yo one and then i got half jackets guys i love half jackets there's this other lime green half jacket i got from mr price and ever since then i was like mm, this is my vibe so i got this uh, black half jacket um it was also in sale from 400 i got it for 239 is is that a bargain or what sure okay and i got leggings these are tights i love tights guys they are so free i prefer tights instead of jeans actually but yeah i got these tights for okay they were not on sale but the price was not bad really like i got these 430 because i remember i bought tights at h&m for 400 never again you can't really i comments and lastly i got this i don't know what do they call this yeah it's a it's a body warmer but a lengthy one not these half puffer jacket stuff so i got this for 220 and it is sugar from i think it, it was 400 rand or 450 but now it's holding it to 20. so guys like i said just don't walk to a comments run i love their items i'm gonna be showing me quality out because it's the first time i'm actually purchasing from them i will give you feedback on what i think of their clothes but their items are very stylish it's modern so i'm not sure about the quality but hey you are going to look nice i mean you can just see the items are pretty much affordable so yeah i thought maybe let me just plug you guys and yeah so yeah let me head to the kitchen and prepare something nice for myself i haven't eaten all day remember i'm on this intermittent fasting thing and you can only eat after 12. so it's currently half past three now and I haven't eaten and I don't feel hungry. I don't know if that's normal, guys. And I'm supposed to stop eating um, at 8 o'clock. Is around 7. Like I stayed the whole day without eating. I don't want to starve myself. I really don't want to starve myself. But I don't feel hungry at all. Even now, I'm just going to snack until um, later when I have supper. So, yeah. It's Friday. It's my chill day, no boo. So I can't wait for him to knock off. I miss him. So bye. So guys yesterday um my boyfriend and i had um a party for two so i was drinking easy rock like yo he kept on bringing those cocktails and he was having wine we slept this morning at 4 a.m i am so tired i'm hungover i'm hungry and after a long day of suffering he finally came to the rescue and um 
bought me Nando's. So yeah, I'll be having a salad and a quarter leg. But nah, I won't be having those wedges. I like them spicy. But yeah, thank God for boyfriends. Hey guys, happy Sunday. I am fully rested, fully recovered. I'm awake, I'm alive. And I just made myself this bowl of goodness. And I thought, let me just share it with you. Um, I'm still on that intermittent fasting tip. So it is after 12, half past 12 now. And this is my very first meal of the day. So, yeah, and then I'm going to down it with some green tea. This green tea. Where is it? This green tea. Love it so much. And, yeah, immediately after that, I'm going to cook the most scrumptious Sunday lunch ever. So, I will check you guys later. Um, Hi, guys. This is what my boyfriend made for us. Sunday lunch and dinner. So we have um, a potato bake, um, green salad, and grilled fish. Bon appetit. Um, hi guys, I hope you are well and I hope you had a wonderful weekend because I surely did. Um, it's a Monday. We are experiencing a cold front. It is snowing outside. More reasons for me to make soup, so I'm gonna start preparing now because you know what soup it takes forever. Um, so yeah, guys, I hope ni wamu ni makaya and those who are working, I'm sorry. That that's what sucks getting a nine to five. And those who are working from home, yay! So those are one of the reasons why I appreciate working from home so much. Because kuya banda. So yeah, I'm going to make chicken soup and yeah, later. Um, guys, I'm going to be making um, soup from these um, white kidney beans. I'm just going to soak them for, um, as they said, quick soak for 60 minutes. And then the annoying part about these beans is that um, after they have softened up, you need to peel them. Like, you need to remove the skin. I'll show you how, though. just gonna mash them um, um because it's gonna be load shedding in an hour i'm not gonna take you guys throughout the entire recipe so i'll just write everything on the screen to whoever is um, interested in making this um, soup for themselves i ran out of chicken so i am going to use minced
um okay guys i'm done the soup is now ready i'm just gonna let everything simmer for the next like 10 to 15 minutes and then dish up oh guys i'm ready to dig in i am having it with um toasted brown bread so yeah let me dig in and bon appetit um hi guys um happy wednesday um you already know what's up um i'm about to join in on our weekly home sale um and i just wanted to close off this vlog on a high spiritual level um i wanted to take you guys with me throughout the session but we are currently experiencing load shading so um my fighter is off and so i can't use the laptop and so yeah i mean the odds are against us in you satan but nevertheless i am just going to leave you with today's topic and the verses that we are going to be discussing today so um today's topic is being led by the spirit and the verses are um corinthians um second corinthians verse 13 to 14 romans 8 verse 12 to 14 romans 8 verse 5 romans 8 verse 26 to 28 and galantians 5 um verse 22 to 28 so um go being led by the spirit we are also going to be talking about what is the holy spirit how do you know that you are being led by the spirit what spirit is moving you um, and lastly what are the fruits of the spirit so yeah that's what we are going to be discussing guys um is a young for a electricity was supposed to be back by six it's 6 30 now i'm even running late for our weekly meeting but before i close off this vlog guys if you have watched this vlog until this far i just want to say thank you so much i really appreciate it please don't forget to subscribe don't forget to share to like and comment love you guys so much our club is growing i can see daily and um i need your help as well for me to move forward so i see you and yeah thank you so much guys Mwah. <laughs>